Hey, what's up, everybody? So, I'm back here again, shocking. Uh, week after week. I believe this is my uh, third week in a row. I'm not sure about it, but... No, I believe it's my second one. I, uh, I saw the Meg, and uh, now I'm back here again. Regardless, I'm back here again in the movie theater that I love going to so much. And uh, I'm going to see another movie this month. And it'll probably be the last one uh, this month. It's called uh, The Happy Time Murders. Yeah, that's the name of it. Uh, it's actually a very cool and funny uh, concept. So imagine this. You live in a world where Muppets are a real thing. Yes, I just said it. Muppets, like from The Muppet Show and uh, uh, Sesame Street. Whoa, darkness, hold on. So, they're alive, they live among us, and like in The Muppets, they had this uh, TV show where uh, the Muppets uh, had a little uh, song and dance, they invited a few celebrity guest stars, and well, years later, uh, some whack job is uh, going around killing them, killing Muppets. Who would have done that? So uh, anyway, it's an R-rated comedy. It's a body cop team-up movie uh, with Melissa McCarthy and a Muppet. Should be a lot of fun. Uh, I've heard some terrible things about this movie. Um, but I also heard some really bad things about The Meg. And I ended up really enjoying myself uh, watching that. So, fingers crossed it's going to be good. Going into it with an open mind. That's... Uh, Really good model for life, uh, especially if you're a movie fan. So, uh, let's go watch it and see if it was worth the money. Hey, what's up? Look where I'm standing. Yep. Hold on, let me just give you a better look. Yeah. I'm part of this poster, yo. The Happy Time Murders poster. Wow. What a movie. Now, if you don't mind, I'm going to take this off. Put this on. Much better. Because if I had to do the entire thing with my sunglasses, yeah, it, it would probably have been stupid. Wow! The Happy Time Murders. What a movie, let me tell you. Oh, look, I've got an aura above my head. Oh. Yeah, I am no saint. Yeah, make sure you remember that. Anyway, um, The Happy Time Murders. I fucking love this movie and yes I said it because it's an R-rated movie and I could see it and I just came out of the movie so I'm a little f-word overdosed speaking of overdose Ooh, uh, yeah you'll know, you'll know what I'm talking about when you uh, see this movie if you will and I hope you will because it's a really fun uh, enjoyable movie and I honestly don't know what the hell uh, those other critics uh, who bashed on the movie were smoking at the time, but damn, I laughed my ass off. Now look, it's not a perfect movie, because it just isn't. No movie is perfect unless its name is The Lion King, let's be honest. And well, let's just say that 20% of the jokes just did not work. They were stupid, they... Uh, uh, put the movie on hold, and they were just not that really good to begin with. Uh, however, that does not exclude the other 80% of the jokes that were completely, unabashedly, unapologetically hilarious. That, that's just, that's just simple math, really. But, um, well, there were several plots that kind of didn't uh, wrap up the way I wanted them to, but we'll get to that later in the uh, actual review. Uh, as of this moment, let me just say, please, don't listen to the critics, just go watch this movie and uh, judge it on your own merits, and trust me, you will not be disappointed. Or maybe you will, and then you'll just hate me forever. Uh, but I can easily say with an open mind, with a look and a hand on my heart, that literally the worst part of the movie was having to sit through Hold on. Having to sit through one, two, three, four, five different logos. 
five, which was just brutal and annoying. That's not even counting this. Hold on. That's not even counting this logo, which is the uh, uh, the, the film company that distributes the uh, the movie to this country. Anywho, once you get past the uh, logos, the movie is fantastic. It's amazing. It's incredible. It's a, it's funny. And I highly recommend you check it out. And uh, who knows, maybe one day we'll make a sequel. Because once you understand the uh, the world building, yeah, it's very easy to make a franchise out of it. Unfortunately, it doesn't look like it's going to happen because the movie's not really doing that well. But yeah, all that can change. Who knows? So, see you guys when I get back home and uh, work on my review. Goodbye. Hello again everybody, I hope you liked this video and if you did, please remember to like, share and subscribe to my channel where I do all kinds of weird stuff like showcase all these things, you know, trailer reactions, movie reviews, all kinds of fun stuff. So, until next time, I'll see you guys next time.